Man, this is a very big show for me because last week marked one year of quitting my job uh, at a corporate level to pursue entertainment. Yeah, that's pretty cool, right? Yeah. And next week I'm going back, so... Um, Now here's the thing, I, I, so I left my job, and when you leave a corporate job to do entertainment, everybody's like, fuck yeah, hopes, dreams, passion, all that shit, right? I'd say it's like 80% that, right? But for me, the 20% that really mattered was the fear of ever having to work another nine to five job, you know? Because here's the thing, if I have to read another email that ends in warm regards, I'm gonna kill myself with a warm butter knife, do you understand? <laughs> Who the fuck do we turn into in these goddamn emails, okay? This work shit is not real, all right? Here's how I know these PC emails aren't real, right? Apply it to your day-to-day -day life, right? Like, let's say you went to In-N-Out, right? Who knows, maybe you got money like that, right? <laughs> you go to In-N-Out, right? They're like, yeah, number 42. You're like, yeah, 42 right here. You walk up and guy goes, okay, sir, here's your burger, enjoy, and uh, warm regards. <laughs> You'd be like, cool, so there's semen in my double-double. <laughs> you can't look another man in the eyes, say warm regards, and not get a little bit of nut in the dub-dub is what I'm trying to say here. That's my new merch dropping tomorrow. Uh -huh. Just got back from Canada, and that shit, I don't know. Yeah? Oh, fuck, I should've done my poutine, Joe. God damn it. Uh, <laughs> Here's the thing about Canada. I don't know what the fuck the weather's doing out there. I was so nervous to go out there, right? Cause here's the thing, I don't do well in the cold. Like my biggest fear as a man is being caught in public with hard nipples. <laughs> See how weird it just got in here, right? Like nobody knows how to talk about dudes with hard nipples yet, right? That's like a very 2024 topic, you know? Like I got band-aids over my shit right now. I didn't know what the AC was gonna be like in here. You know what I'm saying? But on the opposite, for girls, it's one of the sexiest things ever, right? Why is that, right? You ever seen your girl? She just, you know, moved her car in the morning. You know how L.A. be, street parking, right, you know? <laughs> it's cold, she walks back in the house, right? Her nips just waving at you through the little H&M t-shirt, right, you know? It's sexy, you're like, ooh, okay, Vanessa, I see you. No bra Monday, get it, girl, uh, right? It's sexy. Then you ever see a dude out in public with hard nipples? It's like, yo, get this guy away from every school district ever. How the fuck are you not in jail right now? He's just out and about living his best life. Like, y'all get a number three with a large fry? Uh, no, you'll get a number 25 to life, dude. Lock his ass up, bro. Lock him up, man. I've just been thinking about nipples a lot lately and <laughs> I don't want to divide the crowd real quick, but be honest. Has anybody here ever had the luxury of sucking on a pierced titty? Woo! Yeah? Doesn't that shit kind of taste like a harmonica a little bit? <laughs> like Grandpa's World War II harmonica, you know? You can just taste the war stories coming out with each suck, yeah. Yeah, bayonets, uh-huh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Letters to grandma, mm-hmm, yeah. <laughs> I don't know, I just, the reason I'm thinking about nipples is because I was scrolling down my Instagram and I see this shit all the time. Girls love to get their nipples pierced and they love to show social media without telling social media. You know what I'm talking about, right? Scroll down your Instagram, right? You'll see this shit, right? You're just scrolling, 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 going about your day, eating an omelet. I don't know how you live, right? <laughs> and you come across that picture and there it is, ready? It's just like, Boom, titty looks like he's just bench pressing his maximum, you know? You can just see the dumbbells on each side, right? Hitting a new personal record. It's got like a Nike sweatband on and everything, you know? Here's the thing, that's gorgeous, that's beautiful, but what throws me off is the caption never addresses the most obvious thing in the picture, right? It's always just some bullshit Snapple quote, you know? It's like, not all who wander are lost. Uh, like, are we fucking looking at the same picture here? Like, give me a better caption, like, the left nipple's always harder and it hurt too much to get the right ones on, you know, like, hashtag sorry dad, hashtag you're welcome Brad, you know, like, make it make sense, ladies.